I'm George Kelly. And I'm Tony Hicks. And this is 3-Minute News Throwdown, your wrap-up of news and current events. I understand that you have a column that currently addresses one of the popular conundrums uh, in news coverage, the thin line between actual news and performance art. There is a woman performance artist who is going to give birth at an art gallery in Brooklyn as part of a performance art show. Did she obtain an NEA grant? I'd have to get back to you on that. I've seen uh, two deliveries of live children before. Were there any elements of art present in the processes? Only if you consider grunting, moaning, screaming, slime. If those are elements of performance art, then it was, it was incredibly artistic. Is there anything that talks about her prenatal regimen? I'm not sure it's appropriate to give birth in front of a live audience. I don't, I don't know if the customers will pay. I, I don't know if bleachers will be set up. I don't know if there'll be a play-by-play announcer. Let alone the OSHA regulations. Oh. In other late breaking news, we are hearing about the YouTube account for Sesame Street. Apparently it was hacked by someone who thought it was amusing to put pornography on there. Now as a rule, I don't mind pornography, but not on the Sesame Street channel. Not when I'm trying to wake up my three-year-old daughter in the morning and I put the little phone in front of her so she can sing along with Feist. You know, one, two, three, four. Was it pornography with people or was it Muppets? It was people. It wasn't Muppets doing it was people. nasty things to each other. I am sorry to report that it was people. That could really mess up a kid. It would mess me up. Cookie Monster and Big Bird, Bert and Ernie. Let's not go down that road again. <sighs> Snuffleupagus. Again? We have uh, actor Zachary Quinto portraying uh, a young Spock in the Star Trek reboot. Apparently, he's come out as a gay man. As opposed to a gay Vulcan? So all that kissing with Lieutenant Uhura, well, that was kind of wasted, wasn't it? I think any time you get the opportunity to uh, kiss actress Zoe Saldana, it's not a waste. Have you ever had that opportunity? I am survived on all manner of hope. I would kiss Zoe Saldana myself. But if I wasn't married, is that how it works? Mm-hmm. You can't kiss after you get married. You can't even you can't kiss your own mother. I'm George Kelly, and I'm Tony Hicks. Next week, live in studio, real breasts here to discuss Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and not just the two boobs behind the mic. If you like what you've seen in this video, consider that you can subscribe to more Tony Hicks related content on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and a website near you.